Hello, my name is Jürgen Köhler, I'm a keyboard player from Frankfurt, Germany. And today we're going to start tutorials about playing keyboard in a band. So a lot of people come to me telling me, yeah, I got some piano lessons and I learned a song we want to play in the band. I found a sheet in the internet and I learned it on the piano. But can I play this in the band? How does it work? And it's like four pages or seven pages, six pages. Uh, how can I put them on stage, on stand? It doesn't make too much sense in a rock band to have this over there and read it. What to play? So I found a song from Billie Eilish, No Time To Die, on the internet. And we got this piano intro there. And then she starts singing. But in a band. You don't have to play the melody. Because probably you have a singer singing the melody. And she doesn't want you to double that. It doesn't make sense. And the bass player doesn't want you to play the deep notes on the left hand. So there's nothing left to play. Or if you listen to the song, you hear some chords in the verse and in the chorus and special sounds from the orchestra. So we're going to talk about playing chords in the band, kind of comping the song in the band. So those sheets doesn't make any sense. If you can play a solo piano arrangement, you can play that in a hotel bar, but not in the band. So let's throw away those sheets and go inside and have a look for the chords. Okay, so welcome to my studio. Right now we're gonna have a look what to play in Billie Eilish's No Time To Die in the beginning and in the verse. So we start this song with the piano intro. So this is a kind of hook line for the beginning of the song. In the verse, when Billy starts to sing, and you're a singer in the band as well, you don't have to play the melody. So it's more like that. So you see, I play chords on the right hand and a bass note not too deep in the left hand because probably the bass player will play a very deep note over there. So, what are chords? What are triads? What are inversions of triads? How can I build chords on my own? How can I have some ideas with the chords to play? These questions I will answer in the next tutorials to show you what you can do with chords in the band if you play the keyboards. Okay, so see you for next time. Bye bye.